Hello YouTube, it is Jay the Walkman here with part 5 of Let's Play Sarge's Heroes. And um, there's a bazooka vet over there standing very, very intimidatingly. So that's even, so that's even a word. But now he's, varying, now he's lying down for an eternal slumber. I love how intense music, I don't know if you can hear it, but intense music started playing like that, like that dude that was running towards me was like some really intense thing. Man, I wish you guys could have heard the songs in the last, I might just like upload the soundtracks of the music just because I want you guys to hear the song, at least hear the songs that were in the last part. Yeah, see, this is where we could have, uh... Alright, this is a flamethrower up there. I don't know if... I... 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 I uh, man. <laughs> okay. It's worth it if you live. It's worth it if you live. It is. It is. Can I make it if I jump, like... Awesome. All right, we have a flamethrower and a sniper right off the bat, which is pretty good. And a shotgun. We all know how I feel about those. I don't feel about those. That's how I feel about those. Dude! Don't sneak up on a guy who has... You know, who has to get shot like 800 times before he dies. And has an arsenal. And a little pocket seriously I mean people talk about how does Link from Zelda carry around all of these tools how does Sarge carry around an entire arsenal of incredibly heavy <gasps> incredibly heavy weapons I mean he carries bazookas grenade launchers mortars flamethrowers I mean this stuff is heavy I mean an M16 is heavy Especially if you're running around with all this stuff. I mean, he runs and jumps like, what, seven feet in the air? Wow, that was like total luck shot. Where's that guy who shot the bazooka? Is that you? And that's not him. Where is he? Where are you? You know what? Just because I want to use this. I'm getting shot. I didn't know that happened in this game. I knew so something something so evil could happen. I forgot what this game is like rated E or T. Oh. <coughs> it would definitely be rated T nowadays. For like rude probably rated T for rudeness Good to go. or something stupid I mean this game honestly in my opinion should be rated B for babies but you know not that they could actually play them but you're being a plastic soldier I mean these are toys that you know you play with when you're five or that I did at least I was like I played with these things all the way till I was like nine or ten they're like my favorite things and now I just use them for like stop motion clips which I don't know T uh, write in the comments if you think I should do more stop not like that one I did for the trailer but I mean I can actually do some pretty elaborate stop motion stuff I just haven't because that's not what this channel is about I'm thinking about making another channel for just artistic kind of stuff but that would be a while from now because I just don't want to commit to like too much garbage not that I'm not a committer to anything, but I, I, I already have I already have committed to live streams and and um, you know, oh my gosh, lay off me, man, lay off me, lay off, lay off, lay off from your job of living. Uh, where is he? Here's the other machine gun vet. You fool! I'm the one with the sniper, and you're really far away. One plus one equals. Your plastic is getting melted off your face. I need to find some health. A stat. A stat. 
as tin as possible as tin as possible sometimes you can like run over these hills <coughs> but uh it's not really I wouldn't recommend it though because then you're just kind of like asking for it asking for what exactly well must I really tell you must I really tell you must I really not tell you explain We just need that song from uh, Clint Eastwood to start playing right now. Uh, I'm just a little worried that a bazooka guy is going to just like appear. I just I totally remember there's a part where like a bazooka guy appears in your face. <coughs> oh jeez, I think I swallowed a bug. I kid. Or do I? I kid. Or do I? Anything followed by or do I immediately makes you a suspicious person. I wish I had my mortar. That would have been nice. <gasps> we're at the tan camp. And we're already spotted by the people I'd rather not be spotted by. The guy with the bazooka. Good thing he's too... Stupid to aim up here. Man, there's a sniper over there, and all I need. To, oh well, I'll just snipe him off from right here. M16 guy, machine gun guy, and I could have sworn there was a guy over here. Yeah, M16 guy, and up here, possibly. Yeah, sniper guy. I think he got hit in the penis. Uh, another bazooka guy. Definitely want him dead. I shot him in the ankle. Come on. Snipers are beast in this game. And these aren't even 50 cal. I don't even think. These are just like... It looks like a... If it didn't have that big honking cartridge sticking out of the bottom, I'd almost think... We've got a hunting sniper rifle, but you know, it's not like big enough. It's not like a big honker one, but you know, it's pretty decent size. I'm gonna get hurt by going down here, but there's a health pack. I didn't get hurt. What do you know? Uh, I'm gonna come up here because there's a possibility of sniper ammo being found, and that's a possibility I'm willing to make possible. One second, guys. I will be right back with you. Sorry about that, but, you know, guys got to pee when a guy's got to pee. And I feel like we know each other well enough for me to... Except if you're a new viewer, then I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What's been said has been said. You can't get away from me! Oh! Oh! I'm going to take care of this guy for show. Bro, there's a sniper. I don't know where he is, though. I'm getting sniped from some obscure place. He's hitting the tree, though. Is that, is that guy a sniper? He is! Who would have thunk it? Oh, it's a stupid tree is in the way. Um, there's a bazooka over there. And I can't make that jump. No way, Jose. But I'm going to go back down and uh, go through the camp and see if I can salvage anything for my greedy self. Where is he? Bro, I will teach you a lesson about sniping. It's all about... Ow! It's all about location. See, I just shot his... Just shot the bag of douche off of his body. I don't even know if they have that. They're plastic. All right, I, uh, uh, I'm done talking about that. So, how's the weather, guys? Where you are? How's the weather? 
Oh yeah, the last couple days, I forgot to mention in the last ep uh, last part, have been, you know what, there's no, wait, what's that? <gasps> a mortar! Okay, it's totally worth it. Uh, the last couple LPs have been really, I mean, not LPs, days for me have been really busy because I've been live streaming, I've started live streaming, and man, oh man, that is time consuming, especially since I did that, uh, I'm really terrible at Mario 64, that game. And uh, a six hour, I, I made a goal of getting 50 stars. And uh, it took me six hours to get 50 stars. And there were people that watched me uh, stream that, that uh, I, that there were people that watched the stream of me getting 50 stars in like six hours and they watched like the whole way through. So I just like to give an applause to those people because I hadn't done that in the last part like I should have. Um, <coughs> and, uh, yeah, please, uh, come and check out my, my, uh, streams, because, you know, they're a lot of fun, and, um, you know, I don't ban people for ridiculous things, like oh, oh. having a sense of humor or anything like that. Like, I, I've heard that that happens, so, yeah, you don't have to worry about that with me. And, um, also... Also, it's just a lot of fun. I, I, I'm trying, trying to get dedicated to uh, to uh, N64 games. But I might be able to squeeze it in, you know, maybe like an arcade game event uh, every once in a while. But it'll mostly just be N64 games, as I said in the trailer. Dun, 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 dun. Get up there, man. Get up there, man! Awesome. Now, what's that over there? It's a grenade launcher. Okay, we don't care about that. We do not. And I'll say we from now on because, you know, we're all in this together. You're watching these videos. And this one's obviously going to be a little longer than uh, the huge. Oh boy, now i got to get back. <sighs> they purposely put this log here to make it difficult. You just got to remember to press A. <laughs> okay. Stop! Stop! Dude, I was like in the water. Hallelujah. I'm so glad I don't have to go and do all that all over again. Ten shots of the mortar. This is going to be more than enough. Hey! There's our guy! We're saving him. Yeah. Uh, real quick. I'm pretty sure there's a way of getting up here. Ow. There's a bazooka up here, I think. Yeah, yeah. Seriously, all the explosions happening everywhere. You'd think that the tan people would get a little panicky. Um... Yeah, this part... Party time. Yeah, that's right. It is party time. But, uh... This part I never understood because there's like 800 tan soldiers surrounding this one frail dude. Like, I think he's pretty sure he's just an old guy. I'm pretty sure that's the guy we're saving right now. And all he has is a minesweeper, if I remember right. Yeah, yeah, this is the minesweeper guy. So this is just an old dude with glasses with a minesweeper. And the tans, there's like a bagillion of them, won't get anywhere near him. It's like, seriously, you, you guys are pathetic. You, maybe they're, I don't know, maybe they're afraid he like has a minefield around him or something. But he doesn't, so that's the thing. That's the thing about that. After we save him, that's where we get the tanks. Um... Hey! <laughs> oh wow! This is supposed to be auto aiming, but it's not. Uh, uh, why are you still shooting at me? You're way over there. All right, just to be fun, I'm gonna use a mortar on him. So long, de Bowser. So long, de Bowser. I don't even know if that's how you say it, but I don't really care. I don't care. I'm myself. I believe in myself. 
Um, where the heck is he? I know there's a tan guy. I saw him in the wall. Oh, there you are. You're right in there. I'm still going to use that mortar even though it's probably a waste, but... What? Oh, good, you're dead. I was going to say. That's ridiculous. I'm here to rescue you! Oh, that's why they weren't doing it. It's minefield. Yeah, he's supposedly a minesweeper, but I'm the one who has to f locate all the mines so that we don't die. One second, I'm just making sure that this isn't the part with the mines. I'm pretty sure there'll be a sign that says, Hey, you'll probably explode if you don't use the minesweeper at this part. Yeah, we'll probably see those two little gray signs. Yeah, here they are. Yup. Whoops, why did I do that? As you can see, there's an explanation point above a red thing. Assuming... We're going to assume that that's a mine. The only hard part about this is, while you're uh, finding landmines, you're also trying to avoid being murdered by tan soldiers. And you also want to make sure that the guy following you does not stand on a mine. Which, by the way, can happen. And by the way, it sucks. <coughs> and I'm not even going to worry about getting that bazooka because we have a mortar. And uh, mortar trumps bazooka, hands down. Plus, there's like a gazillion mines around that bazooka. It's like they almost put it there. It's like a fishing hook. It's like that SpongeBob episode where SpongeBob and Patrick try... think it's a ride to, like, go and eat the cheese off of those fishing hooks. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. And, uh... In the process they die. Anyways, it's just it's just not a good deal. That's that's all I'm trying to say here. That bazooka it's not a good deal. And for what you could get, I mean really. Oh, I forgot the guy following you doesn't crouch down. Bravo leader 1. I love how the colonel has like a big radio on his back. I mean, shouldn't he have a guy that's supposed to use radios? Right now we're rescuing a guy called Thick. Sarge, if you value your life, get down. We gotta crawl back a little bit for this part. This is the probably the best part to use the mortar in this level. Actually, it is the best part in the level. Where are you, my beautiful green arrow? Arrow X. Double kill! As in, I hit the tank and the dude at the same time. Come on! Sorry, I gotta be quiet for this part because I just want to hit the freaking thing. I don't think there's any other tanks at this part. Nope. We're basically good. Now when we jump down there, I'm sure a million things are going to appear. I'm just letting auto-aim sort of do its work. <gasps> yes, 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 yes. That's exactly what I was talking about. The bazooka guy. He probably didn't even appear. He was probably already there. I just didn't even notice. Alright, this is machine gun time. Seriously, I haven't used this thing at all. Yeah, if you uh, if you turn real quick with Sarge, you can do like a little dance. 
Do, 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 do. And if you like really move the control stick real along, if you hold down right C and you ho and you just sort of you know spaz out with the with the analog stick. Anyways, <coughs> let's um finish this level now. Let's finish the level. Good to go. Oh, I forgot about you. And you. And you. And you. And you! Oh my gosh. Just freaking... Yeah. Wow, 21 minutes. Thanks for watching this episode, guys. Please comment and subscribe. Oh, the code for this place is... Um, remember that. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching.